Yeah, because you know that, that Savannah, when she goes to give Leah the key, you know she'll tell her that the police are right there. And then Leah will go out and investigate what's going on. And when you get home, she'll tell you all about it. <laughs> That's what usually happens. at his work one of the electricians just took the the offer at GM so now there's only three electricians at Minute Maid so they might have to go on one of those shifts where they work three right midnights days and your dad pays into his own pension afternoons or he can pay into his own pension anyways he can't afford it right now well so then 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 it's even better for him to stay where he's at then if they're not taking the money out of him for pension the other, the other. He needs to stay where he's at. But now. He, but Minute Maid might close. Now when Minute Maid closes, if Minute Maid closes. Dad, Dad doesn't want to have to drive to Oshawa every day. That's no. why he's not taking it. Yeah, I wouldn't take it either. He doesn't want to go. He's saying, I finally that's got right. a job in town. He, he, I don't want to move. He won't, he won't work. You know? I know. He, that's why he said. He said, yeah, I'm up for getting more money and getting better pension, but I am not up for driving out to Oshawa every day. <laughs> That's what he said to me. Yeah, when I, when I go wherever with Mia tomorrow too, I could always mail these as well. Because I'm sure wherever we go, there'll be a mailbox. I don't remember what she said she needed to get. She said she needed to go out and get a couple things. Not shopping, but a couple things, whatever they were. I don't remember what she said, though. I don't know, but this white van saved their life like a thousand times since we left home, so it's going to stick right beside him. Not going to pass him. Not going to fall too far behind. Um, yeah, so that's great. Um, yeah, tomorrow we can um, go shopping, right? Is that what you're gonna do, or just go for a walk too? Maybe. Yeah, too. well, Mia, Mia said she needs to get. She needs to go, she did a big, big shop two weeks ago, so she's good for most food, but she said she, she wants to go out tomorrow to get a couple things. I think it's just like bread, and then she, I think she's out of one of her vitamins that she takes, whatever, like a vitamin B or something, whatever for the bones and the crap, like all that stuff, and then there's something else that she had to get, I don't remember what it was. Something important. Just, I don't know. Yeah, I can't remember. So, yeah. And I'm sure if Dad doesn't get this finished today, he'll have to go back to the trailer tomorrow, so. Yeah, you're never really finished until yeah. you get the trailer there. So, so if he does that. Yeah, so if he does that, I'm, I'm just going to get up tomorrow, do my online class try and do some more of my of my my anthology and then I guess go with Mia and then I'll come to your house on Saturday and then we're gonna try and do something to this figure out if we're gonna bind it or use the clips or the, the fleece or whatever like I don't know what I'm gonna do yet I'm gonna look up some online things and then we'll we'll make the decision. 
decision. Friday, yeah. and if they don't have the sale thing there, when you go on Tuesday, <laughs> if you go by Tuesday afternoon, yeah. they'll have all the stock back in. Yeah. So you get two chances to purchase your. Yeah. When I purchased the passion fruit at Walmart, they only had two passion fruits in the the big box where there would have yeah. been full of passion fruit. Yeah. They were so ripe, so you knew right away, like, you can't, you have to eat it immediately. Yeah. So, by the time we took it home and I had put it in the same bag with the corn, yeah. where the fruit was touching the corn, yeah. it was starting to get soggy. Yeah. That's how ripe already it was. So, it's like that. If you want your bananas to get ripe, put them with an apple or put them with another piece of fruit put another piece of fruit with it yeah. just set it beside it did they turn green yet no yeah i know i know tomorrow though like yeah I'm, i for sure i'm gonna wait till i'm at your house on saturday to do the binding but i i know i still have to uh the pages where I put the poetry, I still have three more of those to do, so that's what I'll do tomorrow, and then I'll, I'll bind it at your house. Yeah. But that's why I couldn't finish it up today, is I didn't have my, my glue tape. I forgot it. That's okay. And then we have the, yeah, you can try with your laminate. Yeah. You can do your big, the big rope, it doesn't matter, but we have three yeah. sheets. Yeah, but I have the laminator too, yeah. so. Yeah. Is that Dad? No. Dad's in the truck. It had a piece of the door missing. Yeah. I have to get off this line. Yeah, I don't know why the police were there. Why were the police there? I wonder what happened. They're there all the time, really. Yeah, no, but usually there's a reason why, though. Well, there is a reason. <laughs> like, the reason, the, re the, the other night when the police were over at the boys' house, at the uh, Nikki's house, like that, she just she called the police on herself. Yeah. So the police could just come and talk to her children. Yeah. Because sometimes that just works. Right now, I remember one day Jonah and Leah, I think it was Jonah and Leah, or maybe it was you and Isaiah, um, sat on the couch and phoned 911. Sat there and talked to the lady. Like it was nothing. I was standing there doing the dishes. I've never done that. They meant no harm by it. They weren't calling to whatever, whatever, you know what I mean? But they were just. They have their new devices and they had the option of calling this number and it actually rang yeah. and they could hear somebody, right? They didn't understand that it was like Please the death of it. Yeah. Well, I know I, like, I know right now, I guess police 
police officers that like that there's carries. <laughs> police though are trying not to go to heck like trying not to take too many house calls if they don't have to because of COVID. So they're trying not to go to people's houses unless it's essential. That's what they were saying. Dad's gonna have to come home and get the garbage ready. <laughs> like okay that's only eight days past now it's saying it's not coming till possibly fucking may 27th it's to okay June yeah 17th. it's like they put an audit on us it is what oh, it like, is what the hell yeah, they at least they come in may control right they have control yeah. we're asking they don't have to give us nothing yeah. and they're just like this thing yeah. so they can have everything Good night. 